What happens when you die? Death, just like life, is a process. As death nears, people tend to have less energy and less of an appetite. In some cases of long-term illness, especially cancer, the body makes a chemical called catecholamine, which suppresses appetite. In addition, because they have less energy, their digestion might not be working as well, so eating might make them feel nauseous. Essentially, don't be surprised if a dying loved one is eating less and losing weight. It's common for dying people to stay home and sleep because they're so tired. Processes that require energy tend to slow down, such as the ability to move, think, talk, and regulate body temperature. Medications can also contribute to this. Oncoming death can cause a person to also have irregular breathing, but this doesn't appear to make the person uncomfortable, and neither does the so-called death rattle, when air in the throat and chest passes over secretions that build up. As for senses, smell and taste usually go first, but hearing tends to be the last one to go, so feel free to talk to a dying loved one, even if the person isn't responding to you. When the end comes, regardless of cause, doctors check for a cardiac death when the heart stops beating, or brain death when the electrical activity in the brain stops before pronouncing someone legally dead. Death, one of the mysteries of life. If you'd like even more Life's Little Mysteries, check out these videos and read even more on LiveScience.com.